This YouTube shows you how a hospital could quickly build a balance scorecard or performance measurement and management system in Actuate in just five days. My name is Brett Knowles and I run a consulting boutique that specializes in the balance scorecard. We've been working with doctors Kaplan and Norton since the late 1980s and every single book that they've written cite our clients as best case examples as do most of the other seminal books on the balance scorecard. The five phases that we take our clients through are as follows. First, building the strategy map. Then, adding in indicators from the existing performance measurement inventory. From there, translating strategy into action by listing the core processes against those strategic objectives and understanding how they support the strategy and enabling us to build not only a drill down, but the linkage to the initiatives and that project management activity. From there, we help establish the right management practices and finally launch the system. Let's take a look at each one of these steps in a bit more detail. We should be able to build the strategy map using the standard four perspectives of the balance scorecard. And we're going to use the existing strategy, which in most organizations is well documented. If you take a look at the mission, vision, values, out of it we can extract the core strategic objectives that the organization needs to work from, along with the other managerial reports, strategy documents, and so forth. There's typically no shortage of strategy, just a shortage of explaining how it works. We should be able to take those strategic objectives and place them in the right perspective and then begin to add in the cause and effect arrows that explain how these objectives work with each other. And then once we have the arrows in place that explain how they relate, add in their weighting. If this is 100% of your strategy, what's our focus for this year? In this case, if we take a look at the weightings over 10%, it's about developing innovative patient care by building the team, providing service excellence that enables both treating with compassion and dignity and delivering physical, emotional, and spiritual care. From here, we can add in performance measures from the existing data so that they turn red, yellow, and green based on how we're performing against target. Now this is good, but we need to communicate it with the whole organization. We need a way to make it like a web page available so that anyone can drill into the data to understand how we're performing. Not only at the overall surface level, but drill into it to be able to see index performance and the owner's commentary on how we're performing. Now that's a scorecard, but it's not enough. We now need to be able to take that strategy and list those objectives down the left of a matrix and across the top, the existing process work, whether they're a lean or a Six Sigma shop, how it is we take a look at our processes. Because the processes are there to support the strategy, we should be able to take a look at each strategic objective and understand how each process supports it. So in this case, how does the emergency department support treating with compassion? And once we evaluate that, again, red, yellow, green, based on how we're performing, we can eventually understand how to translate strategy into action. Where this takes us is we can now build a drill down, in this case, on how to create a healthier world so that we can drill through those strategic objectives to the operational objectives to the process, projects, and tasks that enable it and allow management to drill through the data to see what's causing the performance that we're observing. Actuate allows us to do this through the hierarchy and the dashboard. From there, we can then begin the other part of strategy execution, which are the projects or initiatives. And again, rate them against the strategic objectives and begin to build a drill down so that within each objective, we can also understand what are the projects associated with it and how are they performing. Now, the five steps that we talked about were building the strategy map, adding in the indicators, linking it to the processes and projects so we can have the drill down and portfolio management capability, changing the management practices, and then launching the system. Most organizations can do this in under five days, and certainly all are done within two weeks. To learn more about how to implement Actuate and other concepts around the scorecard, join us at pm2consulting.com under the Insights tab.